तेल जा रहे हैं बेटा हम लोग तेल जा रहे बाइक छोटा बाइक बड़ा फिर बड़ा वाला बाइक फिर बड़ा बाइक बड़ा वाला बाइक ये नहीं होता है हाँ हे Hey, good afternoon, folks. A very good afternoon from Hyderabad. The heat is next level. If you can see, I'm sweating. I just had a bath, and I'm still still sweating. So today I'm going to get my new Royal Enfield Interceptor 650 after a wait of almost close to three three and a half months. And this guy is also excited because he'll get his small Royal Enfield, right? <laughs> Chota wala Royal Enfield. Okay. So this will be a very small vlog. I'm just taking the deliver of the bike. Nothing fancy. Uh, so I just wanted to share my uh, my happiness with you guys. Uh, so you just go to the showroom and probably vlog yeah, over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See you in the showroom. Bye. सॉलिड कदा This is the black ray in all its glory. Uh, it definitely looks beautiful, man. It looks international for sure, right? If you see the Triumph Street Twin or something of an international brand, right? The retro bikes. This definitely gives competition to that, especially this color with the alloys, right? It looks next level. Uh, so I've not done any photo shoot on this yet. Uh, it's me sitting on it, but I will do that and put on my Instagram. And, and I'm I'm sure it will it will look definitely dope. Right. And and also this this bike looks at this big when compared to the Prime Street Twin. So I had one of my colleague who is having a Street Twin. I just parked this next to him, and then I saw that that bike was little little tiny and puny because of its smaller tires and total smaller um, bike. And it is a little lighter also. This is a little heavier than that. But yes, this does give you that big bike feel for sure. Right. So in in terms of accessories, nothing much. So I just had this guard. So this is mandatory, guys, because in, in In an unfortunate case, when you fall, you need to make sure that your your leg doesn't get hurt. Right, so this is really important. You even get the smaller engine guard, but I really wanted to go for the bigger one. I know the look 
uh, it is okay it is black it actually uh, for this particular bike it, it 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 doesn't show out much but i think this is very important that you need to have a bigger guard i think that is the only thing that i changed apart from that i i got this touring seat uh, because this is coming from factory so i just didn't want the original seat because i've heard that the original seat hurts a lot for a longer time and this is good enough uh, for me till now this is good enough i think these are the only two things that i got done right now uh, there are a couple of things that i want to do probably uh, i want to get an aftermarket radiator guard so right now you do have a radiator guard uh, it's a pretty basic part but i think i think they can do a better job with the radiator guard radiator guard on that right so this is this i want everything to be black you get an accessory to make this to make this black as well i'll get that right and also on the brake right i have one problem with the brake and that is the lever here is round uh, it doesn't give me much grip to hold on to press it right so that is something that i am not really fan of i need to get a cover for this because this is exposed similarly i will change something on this right and and to talk about the changes you can go on youtube and see what all changes are there. i don't want to blab about that because there are a lot of videos online but the most important things are you have adjustable levers now uh, if you can see here adjustable levers you have this meteor 650 type dials where you can just uh, you know for for switching on and off ignition and similarly for the light so these are basically very good quality plastic not metal but yeah i think they are they are better than uh, what they were provided earlier and also you get this hazard lights now uh, where all of the lights blink together that that is given by default correct right? uh, so i i am not planning to um, add any many accessories to this because i like the stock it looks really dope uh, i i don't like to name my bikes as well uh, i don't know this is a trend on youtube but um, but for this specifically in my mind whenever i see it i get the name my fury <laughs> just because it is so dark uh, uh, even at night when there is no light you can't even see this bike it is so dark and it is beautiful man it is just beautiful just look at it it is just and it is and when i was traveling on the roads right everyone is looking at this bike they are stopping and looking at this bike so it is just a stealer looks great so that's about the bike and the delivery guys nothing much and uh, one more thing that they added was a led light from super meteor uh, i think even that is good that is great and obviously the alloys with cr tires and i think when they once they wear out i'll go with the other uh, wooden stain later on but not right now and the two important uh, changes that i would do is an air filter over there and and one spark plug iridium spark plug over there so the only reason for me to get those done is if i go on high altitude trips probably like ladakh or any other hill station right these two will give a really good performance in those areas probably the performance improvement might be a little uh, here in city but yes overall it will be a great uh, addition to the bike okay so we'll close this vlog i'll just show you the exhaust sound of this bike uh, it is pretty sweet decent uh, it is not too loud but that is how i like it and, and i think i'm not really changing the exhaust because this exhaust also looks top Okay, so that's about the delivery and my experience, my happiness that I want to share with you. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Peace.